Hi everybody, this is Juliana and I have a card to share with you today. So um, I've been coloring and practicing with my Copics that I bought a while back and I've been coloring a bunch of images and I've made this card using this really gorgeous stamp by Magnolia and I use a bunch of products from um, Carla's Etsy store that I really really love so I'm going to share with you some of the things that I did with this card so first of all this is a five and a half and a five and a half card and I cut it with cardstock and then I cover the card the front page with the paper collection from my mind's eye and this one is called blush and it's like these really gorgeous pages of paper really super beautiful paper so this is where the paper comes from and then I use one of the Spellbinders um, doilies um, die cut here on the back and I really really love that and I just like put some ink around the edges I color um, her and this stamp is by Magnolia and it's Tilda with the butterfly dress. I really love this stamp. She's like so, so super cute. So I color her with my Copics markers. And um, over here, I put a little bit of um, glitter. And she's holding a little rose in there. And I use Carla's um, flower pearl trim for the rose. So isn't that just super cute? I just love it. Um, and here on the back, I've added some ribbon from my stash. It's like this really gorgeous trim. And then I added this gorgeous flower pearl trim here from Carla's Etsy. And it looks like this. It's like super gorgeous trim. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? So I use that here on each side of the card. And then I added some Prima um, flowers here, some flower stems from Carla's Etsy store, and some of the little tiny mini um, Martha Stewart uh, butterflies. They're just really cute. And then I just added some pearls here on the top and on the bottom, just to give it a little bit more of an accent. And then here on the side, I used one of um, Carla's crystal flowers in 3D. And it's this really, really gorgeous pink flower. I love this. And on the bottom of the flower there, I used this um, rose trim that Carla is also carrying at her store. So what I did is I just put this on top of it. And like it gives it a little bit more of a pink look. So I tried to stay with the pinks and the burgundy color. Really love it. Um, these little two roses here are, some, are from my stash. And they're just like made of like satin or something like fabric it's really cute and here on the bottom i use this really gorgeous lace from carla's etsy along with the flower trim again and the lace looks like this it's like really gorgeous and it's perfect for cards because it's like really thin and small so look at this you guys it's not beautiful like this is seriously one of my favorite ones so far really really gorgeous um, so I put that on the bottom there. So there's take a look of the front page. And then um, on the inside here, I cover it with the paper collection again. And then I added this really gorgeous like beige cream color trim from Carla's Etsy. And that one looks like this. And it's super gorgeous and perfect for cards also. So there it is, you guys. I left it pretty um, plain and simple on the inside. Um, just in case I give this card to somebody, I could just add like a sentiment with a stamp or something like that. But I wanted to share this with you guys. And here in the back is just white um, cardstock. I hope you guys like this card. I will be making a couple of more, more cards um, here soon since I'm practicing with a bunch of different stamps. And I just like really, really love the Magnolia stamps here. She's so cute. So thank you so much everybody for watching. Please be sure to check out um, Carla's Etsy store. I will put the link of the products that I use for this card. And I will guys, see you guys soon with a couple of videos. Bye bye.